Hi, and welcome to You Deserve a Drink. I'm Mamrie Hart, and who do I think most deserves a drink this week? Well, it's the second cutest pussy in Hollywood, Lil Bub! Lil Bub is in New York City this week, premiering her new film, Lil Bub and Friends, and we think this hard-working feminist deserves a cocktail. So we're gonna make a Lil Bub, Lil Burb! Lil Bub, with this premiere, you must have walked the red carpet. You know, I walked the red carpet this morning, it's before I trimmed them. <laughs> carpet matches the drapes. For this drink, all you're gonna need is milk, amaretto, Kentucky bourbon, and cardamom coffee. I'll teach you how to make it in the bottom. Legend has it you were found in a tool shed, bub, and I can also be found in a tool shed. It's my favorite all-male review. <laughs> I miss you, Rick. To a shaker full of ice, add a little bit of milk. I'm using soy milk because my digestive system sucks. I tell you what, we're two peas in a pod. You hang out with Grumpy Cat, and I'm dumpy and fat. I get emotional when I drink at 9 a.m. Sorry, be right back. Did you say something? Add a little bit of amaretto. Bub, you have such a dramatic look. Have you thought about maybe doing, I don't know, a, a bit part on the tongue and the restless? A little bit of bourbon. Wanna trade in your friskies for whiskey, bub? Okay. That's the money shot. We actually have quite a bit in common, bub. You use kitty litter, and I have a witty Twitter. At Mametown, y'all. Bub, what's your handle? I tell you, your handle isn't handling liquor. And then, a little cardamom coffee. You're so exotic, I thought you needed some exotic flavors. I hear that fellow feline, Colonel Meow, is in your film. You know, I'm close to the Colonel, too. Sanders. I love that original recipe. Try to give me away. All right, so we're gonna shake it up. So much in common, Bob. I mean, you're from outer space, and this is my chowder space. Inappropriate to say to a cat. I apologize. It's the whiskey. And there you have it. A little bubs, little burbs. Oh yeah. Just for a little extra finish, we'll put a little nutmeg on top. A couple of nuts. Oh, there we go. Little bub, any advice on how to get rid of hairballs? I went to a pretty crazy sleepover last night. Oh God, I think Megan's in there. One just your size. Cheers! Woo! That is out of this world like you, bubs. So you have 22 claws when the average cat has 18. Let's just say you're nailing it. Nails like a claw. Thank you for watching You Deserve a Drink. Again, I'm Mamrie Hart. And remember, the best part about Why Dad is the built-in drinking game. So make your delicious little bub, little burbs, re-watch this and drink every time I make a terrible little bub pun. Now I'm off to lick myself, probably. Little bubs, you cool? Did you cross your eyes on that part? I'll just, okay. <laughs> they say that cats have nine lives. Well, they aren't the only one. I play a lot of Sims by myself. It's lonely out there. Two in cat years is 21 in regular years, right? Uh. <laughs> Too many amarettos and I'm a gargetto. I'm telling you, we're gonna be best friends. We have so much in common, mainly that we both have gotten all our shots. Ay, 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 ay. Now where, <laughs> now where were we? It's really tough to say when you drank half a martini. This is not going as planned. You are toe up from the flow up. Do you have a ride? <laughs> I love it. <laughs> my and I'll be burping. Not a fan. I don't, I, I don't blame you.